morning. Good morning. I'm going to stand this morning before you to introduce our speaker for our men day program this morning. I think after my introduction, we have another selection from the male course, uh, and then our speaker will come up. Our speaker today, he's the youngest of four siblings born to the late Charlie and Ruby Vincent. Reared up, grew up right here, educated in Calhoun County, graduated from High School, also Carroll County Vocational School for drafting. Some of his work experience, Field Manufacturing Company as a fixer and wet finishing department, William Bonnell Company, maintenance repairman, self-employed contractor, grading, hauling, landscaping, demolition, wrecking, gambling skylight, fabricator, installer, truck driver. He's married to my aunt, uh, Ms. Bobby Vincent, have seven children, 13 grandkids, six great-grandkids. While at, at uh, Mount Zion Baptist Church, he was ordained as a deacon under the leadership of uh, Reverend J.W. Russell Sr. and the late Jimmy Hennett. Uh, other position he held was usher, Sunday school teacher, assistant chairman uh, of the deacon board. And I, I just want to say this, just throw on a little bit of my own in there. Uh, I've known this, this, this fellow for uh, quite a while. And I want to say this, any of you young men out there, your parents out there, if you want, want your young man to experience what hard work is all about, let him work with our speaker for one day on the project. Because he is truly a hard, hard, hard working man. I've seen him do it for years and years, and I had a chance to work with him a little bit. I'm not afraid of a little hard work. I had a chance to work with him a little bit in the, in the month of July. Lord, I mean, from sun up to sun down, he's a hard working young man. So if you want your young man to stay in school and get an education, let him work. Well, I'll speak one day on the project. I'm sure he wouldn't mind. Let him work. Let him work one day on the project. I promise you, he'll get right and stay in school. And I'm going to tell you right now, if he speak to you this morning as hard as he work, we're going to be in for you. After our good fortune for selection, the next voice we'll hear after that will be our speaker for the day, Deacon Melvin Vincent. Amen. Amen. 